following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. I'd like an Atari 2600 system, please. Tell me, you're buying it because it plays hundreds of fun and challenging games, right? Uh, no. Oh, then it's because of its incredibly low price? Uh, not really. Well, it must be because its new and exciting games are now priced lower than ever. Uh-uh. Then why are you buying the Atari 2600? You see this cute little girl over here? Yes. She's relentless. The Atari 2600 video game system and its new exciting games at a new low price. Welcome back to the Collector Zone. I'm Jeff Dickinson, and this is an unboxing of a Pi 4. I got through Amazon, and if you've been following the channel, I, you know, shared one of my builds, and I have a Pi 3B, and so today I wanted to check out how cool this is. Now, uh, I'll put a link below if you want to score one. I've never had a uh, complete in-the-kit pie before, so this is going to be kind of cool. Oh, wow. It's got a lot of shit, man. All right, let's see here. So this is a little chart board, I guess. Yeah. Like I said, this is my first time going through a complete kit here. Let's see here. Read me first. Okay. <laughs> I don't even read instructions on the uh, manuals for the games, man. Why should I bother with this? No, I'm joking. I'll, I'll probably check it out. This is your HDMI cable. It's probably heat, heat sink. Yeah. I think that's what it is. I'm not sure. I don't know if you can see through it. I can barely see through it. That's what it says right there. Yep. Well, okay. This is our pie, so we'll go check that out. Came with a case, man. I have, my other one has a case too, so this is kind of cool. So I'm upgrading, man. This is gonna be cool. And uh, from what I understand, all these pies are backwards compatible, so my images from my pie three should be, you know, be cool. Okay, there's the heat sinks taped to the <laughs> power supply. And it's cool they got a power supply here. I think this one has a switch. It doesn't say much on the box, but yeah. Cool. All right. What else we got? We got... Oh, this is our USB. Okay, so we could transfer data. Cool, cool. There's a fan. I heard the Pi 4s run a little hot, so now we get a fan. That's kind of cool. Let's see here. Oh, this is your uh, yeah, micro USB reader. Cool. And it has a book here. Let's take a look at the book real quick. I don't know if I can go through the whole thing, but this is your Quick start guide. Flip through here a little bit here. Kind of cool. Now, of course, I've been playing with the images before, so it'd be fun to dive in and enjoy <laughs> the world of Pi 4. Hopefully you're seeing all that. I know this will help a lot of folks and probably me if I screw anything up. I try not to mess up, man, but you know what? I get in a hurry. Like I want to hop in there and play that game. I want to hop in here and start programming. Hopefully you see all that. A little LED button, oh, yeah. well, button it says, or a little jumper wire. Okay, a little more fancier bells and whistles on it. Yeah, pretty cool. Pretty cool. Let's see here. I don't know. 
upside down? <laughs> I can't be helpful if it's upside down, right? Oh, it's like this. Hopefully you can see all that. Pretty cool. Little advertisements. And now, what we've been waiting for. The actual board. The uh, Pi 3 I have is one gigabyte of RAM. So, this one has eight. So it says, open here, okay, is it taped, it's not taped, maybe get my little knife out here, oh I see, oh okay, look at that, it comes right out like that, and it gives you a little a reference guide. They really don't want me to fucking this up. <laughs> Here's a user guide. I'm not gonna go show you guys all that. But here's the board. Pretty cool. Like I said, I'll put a link below if you want to score. This is, like I said, an Amazon find. Yeah. Pretty badass, man. I'm I'm happy. Got my Pi 4 in. Well, guys, thanks for the hang time. Big shout out to my new subscribers. I appreciate you guys coming aboard and being part of the Collector Zone. But it's to you OGs I owe the most to because you guys were there at the beginning when this is all underground, man. Until next time. Game on. I'm going to go ahead and try to put this together and see what I can do for future videos. Laters.